today's your birthday. Yay! July 25th, we're gonna make a blue velvet vegan cake, but I'm not gonna do this alone. No, because you know we have fun on your birthday. So, I'm gonna do it with. Hey guys. This is, what's your name? Giselle. This is Giselle. So a fun fact about Giselle, she actually has really curly hair, but as you can tell, it's straight because she got a haircut. And she cut off like three inches of her hair. So yeah, RIP. Anyways, <laughs> Mexican household. I thought my grandma cared about me. Did you want to say something? So you know, we're just casually taking out um, all the pans and stuff from here because ovens are only used for storage. So yeah. So you can see I have no cabinets right now because we're gonna redo my kitchen. So just ignore that this whole video. I'm sorry. But first thing we're gonna do is preheat the oven at 350. What are you looking at? So just just give me a weird look. First thing you're gonna do is preheat the oven at 350. So you wanna preheat it to 350. After you preheat your oven, we have like the measurements of stuff on her phone so that we could tell you guys. But oh wait, we need a little. Should I use a hand mixer? No, I need a little machine. Now. Oh, we tried to find the hand mixer for like <clears throat> five minutes, but all my stuff is in boxes, so we're going to have to stick with this, but it's okay guys, you will gain muscle too. First thing you're going to do is sift your flour, sugar, baking soda, salt, and cocoa powder, and we're going to put in two cups of flour, so she's going to pour it, and I'm going to sift it. Oh, wait. When half of it's not even going in the okay okay <laughs> calm down calm down <laughs> half of it's not even going in the thing i think you sift it so that it comes out more fluffy i don't really know tbh all right go you don't have lumps in your cake oh lumps or like so like it's not like the the oh my god the cake doesn't seem so like grainy is that what i'm trying to say oh. okay now we're gonna put in the sugar sugar a lot of freaking sugar in this cake. Guys, it's one it's one cup of sugar. And that kind of seems like a lot. Just pour all of it. Okay. Alright, now we're gonna add in one teaspoon of baking soda. One half a teaspoon of salt. And then one tablespoon of cocoa powder. The stupid sugar. Next thing, we've already prepared the vegan buttermilk, which you just pour a tablespoon of lemon and then you fill it up to the one cup line of soy milk. Now we're gonna add. Okay. Now, we're going to add the buttermilk. You want to add the buttermilk? It's one cup of the vegan buttermilk. <laughs> then we're going to add the two tablespoons of vanilla. The one third cup of vegetable oil. Ew, look at it. Zoom into this. Can you see this right here? It looks like condensed milk, actually. Oh, and then we're going to add vinegar, which is really weird, but you need one tablespoon of white vinegar. Um, Fun fact, we had to get this from my neighbor, and I was kind of scared because I don't talk to them, but she was really nice, so it's okay. Um. Oh, then we're going to add our food coloring. I'm going to make it blue. So, yeah. Oh, snap. Okay. Here, you can do that. Um, meanwhile, I'm going to grease the pan. The way that I'm going to grease the pan is I'm going to take vegan... Butter? <laughs> Dude, it's really thick. I think we did something wrong. I don't think there was enough liquid. It doesn't look like there was enough liquid. But it didn't say anything it else. It doesn't even look blue. It Let's look just keep brown. mixing. I'm scared. I mean, it's supposed to be thick. Okay, but this is like brownie mix. I think we let it sit too long. I think we did. What if I put some milk in there? What if I mess everything up? Just leave it. But it doesn't look right. Guys, I think it looks pretty normal. That looks like brownie batter. 
Okay, wait, just scrape the side. But it's still cookable. Okay, yeah, that's true. But what if it's not even like a cake anymore? What if I know what we're done baking? I think if we put a lot of work, I doubt it. It's just brown. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna make a difference. Oh wait, maybe. Okay, so yeah. Anyways, back to how you grease it. So you're gonna take vegan butter and flour. It works. And okay. So yeah, and then you need a paper towel because that's just how you spread it around and stuff. It works. Okay. It kind of looks like turquoise. Yeah. It looks pretty though. Alright, let's hope it works, guys. I'm really scared. I've never done this before. If it doesn't work, then I guess I'm not having a birthday. Guys, make sure to go say happy birthday. So, I think I put a lot of flour, but then you just kind of move it around. Now we're going to attempt to pour this in the pan. Okay, wait, should we take the whisk out? It looks like a forest cake. Kind of. We're going to put it in the oven for... 30 minutes, okay, and we're putting it at 350. I should have moved the thing, but I forgot. So let's hope everything goes well. All right, guys, it's gonna be fine, okay? It'll be great. We'll be icing the cake in no time. All right, guys, you already know the fun part. We have to wash all the dishes. dishes. So we're gonna get the ingredients for that. Sprinkles. We're gonna use um, sugar and put it in the blue. I think, wait, we need butter. So let me the butter. Vegan butter. We also need powdered sugar. Peppa. What are you doing on my shelves? I kinda, um, I kinda made a mess, but it's okay. We're just gonna measure out our ingredients and then we'll come back to you right now. My toes. Oh. <laughs> okay, so for the frosting, we have three and three fourths of powdered sugar, which is a lot to me. Then vegan butter. We need three tablespoons of that. So we're gonna put that in right now. You wanna do it? Wait, how much? Three tablespoons. Yeah. Okay. Then we also need we have lemon because you need four tablespoons of lemon because it's like some lemon frosting, and then one tablespoon of vanilla. So I'll give you guys close-up right now. Okay, guys, I like. We need one teaspoon of vanilla. Yeah, that's not one. A tis. I'm gonna get the whisk. <laughs> They're gonna be like, why don't you use a squeezer? Because it doesn't squish, okay? A seed. Oh, we didn't check for seeds the other time. Yeah, we didn't. <laughs> if any of you guys find a seed inside of Drea's cake, you know what? There's one right here. Four and the hand burn. Okay, I don't need the oh. teaspoon number, right? No. We should have melted it. Not melted, but just let it get soft. It will work. Just let the butter get a little soft. Put it outside in the sun. I'm making a mess. I haven't gone outside all day. <gasps> Guys, Peppa does not want to leave my kitchen. I think she's in love. I think that this was not a good idea. Who let me do this? I think that I'm not able to bake. Like, I can cook. Like, I'm really good at cooking, but I don't think I that I can bake. I made you a sandwich today. No, I honestly, I know how to make really good food, okay? Like, really good food. Like, I make vegan food sometimes. Most of the time. And she says she's not vegan, Grace. I'm not. No, she eats this vegan food. And look who's making a vegan cake. <laughs> Alright, guys. We're now in the sun. Just casually trying to get this butter to melt. 
I don't know if it's working, but it's honestly like 10,000 degrees outside. So, gonna try it. This is a nice background. It's really good. I think that I'm only a icing pro, because I don't know about that cake. Maybe I should just, <gasps> did I break? I broke it. It's because the icing is a little thick. Uh, okay. I think that it worked honestly. Being in the sun. Hey guys, welcome back to my ASMR channel. Today we're gonna be tapping on a bowl. So listen up. Alright guys, back to the kitchen. Time to ice. I'm kinda scared. Guys, it was supposed to be really blue thick. and it actually turned out to be brown. Yeah. Because basically the recipe called for regular cacao powder and I got dark chocolate because dark chocolate is superior to any other chocolate. And guys, Peppa has joined us today on our YouTube channel. Me and Peppa the homegirl. Don't even question why Drea has a Peppa. Yes. Okay. I just have one. Okay. Goofed, guys. Everything that went wrong in this video, I will fix right now. This is what it looks like. You know, it was honestly really pretty until I put blue on the side. And now it just makes me want to cry a little bit. But all that matters is that it's going to taste good. So, thanks for joining me today as I made my birthday cake. Um, we encountered many things like looking like it's part of the ocean like finding peppa in my cabinet like having giselle join me today um I'll, i'm also turning to smurf and yeah i'm behind the camera guys back um don't let me bake ever again but i will come to you guys with cooking videos because honestly my food's really good so let's go put this in the freezer i'm putting it in the freezer because i have no space in my fridge But no baking videos, just cooking videos and other stuff that you want to see. So comment down below, let me know, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.